Hello there, Golf Freak here, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Civilization V. We last left off, I was just building some stuff, and just thinking about, uh, well, I need some resources. Because, and he's hostile with me. And they want my land. I uh, see, you have nothing. Oh, you have some luxury resource. You have a luxury resource. So, I'll take this if I give you dyes and gems. How's that sound? Nah, no. There we go. So we be, but we both get something and it's better than nothing for me. Plus he's my friend, so that's fine for me. Now, I really would like it if if they emphasize more like friendships. Like if you're really friendly with the Civ, they won't like necessarily trust you completely. But they'll be more willing to do stuff, and way more willing, and it's kind of more like a friendly bias. Like, they'll just ask you, or just talk to you, or something like that, to that regard. And that's what I was worried about, that they were going to attack me. I'm at a disadvantage, and I lost a spearman. Yep. That's not good. Japan's trying to destroy me. I'm being destroyed by barbarians. You need an embark. There's really no point in keeping this scout anymore. I might just delete him. And deleting him two gold if I do it in my borders, that's not a big deal. And I get two gold saved, so in the long run it's fast, it's more efficient to do that. Oh, and I can probably build the Oracle here, except. But I want some better units. Barracks would not be a bad idea. I think I'll do that. Or do I want a library? I want a library. I need to get more science. The more science, get more advanced units. More advanced units means I don't need a barracks. At least that's my logic for doing that. Let's see if my science shoots up. 25 right now. 29. Very nice. Choose production, you finish the library down here. See, the walls of Babylon are quite... S and increase the... Up okay, and the Oracle take 19 turns. You are getting five... Yeah, do the Oracle. See, Babylon's not a very good production city. My goodness. Let's just keep on hoping on so we reach the, the year 0 AD. Better is bread with a happy heart than wealth with vexation. I'm in Hotep. Care about you, city state. Um, I kind of want to build a mine here, but it wants me to build a trading post, which is okay. She's production. Finished a granary over here, but put a library. Get a library in every place. Choose my next research. Horseback riding is the quickest one. Might as well get that one out of the way. Yeah, build that, adopt the policy. And we will get Republic. And hopefully that will help my production a little bit. And they have swordsmen. <laughs> now one production should help a decent amount. I'm getting a lot of gold per turn, actually. I'm kind of surprised. You're done, so you can come over here then. And I'm just going to check to see if I... Wait, we're friendly? What? We've denounced each other, and we've made a declaration of... What? Okay, I'm not sure if that's a glitch in the game, or the fact that they just don't want to tick me off. 
I wonder if the computer's like cheating. It's like, okay, I want to destroy him. In fact, I'm so angry at him, I just want to completely annihilate him from the game. But we'll make it friendly so he thinks that we're not going to kill him. In that case, that's really cheap. And I don't think that they programmed that into it. We will see, but oh my gosh. Arabia is just doing terrible. Yeah, see, I can see stuff I haven't seen yet uh, out of my fog of war. Or in the fog of war. So they haven't expanded at all. My goodness. Yeah, there's not a whole lot going on. I actually don't have a lot of horse horses, but that's I have four. That should be enough. I'm gonna need some iron in a little bit. I have four happiness. I can always build a circus. But I think I'm gonna have to build another city in a little bit. Open borders? Definitely. So what do you You're my buddy. A horse. My kingdom for a horse. Okay, you're done there. Come down here then. And build another farm. And how much food is that plot getting me? I'll give me four food. Okay, that's pretty good. And I really wish I'd just show you like what they're working if you have this out so you can see like what tiles they're working without needing to go into the city screen. That would be quite nice. And you finished that. I don't need gold, actually. I've got 34 gold per turn. That's an insane amount. So the market is not that big a deal. So we're going to need units. I mean, definitely. I mean, I could spend... Or I could build gold and have a massive amount and then build units, but... I'd like... One swordsman for now. I'd like one swordsman and buy one more bowman and send that bowman down to my next place where I have my next city and then build that. But we'll see. Theology sounds nice. I don't like the fact that I only have a. Oh, holy cow! See, here he comes. He's friendly with me until he kills me. And. Okay, you've built that. Someone's starving. I don't know why. Who's starving? You guys are starving? You have no reason to be starving. Ooh, auto. So he's declared war on. He declared war! Oh, wow! So. That is really helpful that he declared war. So he, he really hates everybody. That's telling me that he hates everybody. And that I might have to go to war with him. To protect my buddies. But the fact is that, that because he's at war with someone else, he probably won't go to war with me. Which is fine with me. Anyway. You really don't have a lot you can build. Um, Lighthouse would be okay, but there's no real reason to. So we'll have you build a market. Because you're not going to be able to build units quickly. So might as well get the buildings out of the way. Oh, look at this. There we go. See, I knew it showed it. He has one more city. So he might be able to expand a little bit more, but he's going to be so weak, I think, that I'll easily be able to take him just a couple units. And the sign city is also spreading down, because I can easily settle here, because I want this iron gems. It's right here. One, two, three. One, two. One, two. When pieces of bronze or gold or iron break, the metalsmith welds them together again in the fire. And the bond is established. All right, so I have so much gold. So Aseka has is complete with Aseka. So we're going to talk to him again and see if he has enough gold. Oh, he doesn't have enough gold. But he's making a decent amount of gold per turn. So I'll uh, look again in a little bit. And you can come up here. Trading post. 
Okay, looking good. Well, I'm going to cut the video off here. So, thanks for watching, and God bless.